This is very important because we know that 70% uh, of all uh, viruses and pathogens come from the animal world. Uh, some of them are known, we know, uh, some of them are unknown, so it is quite a, a serious matter to try as an emergency measure to stop selling uh, life, life wild animals in uh, traditional food markets uh, uh, as a, a precautionary measure. We issue hundreds of guidance since the beginning of uh, COVID-19, so this is one of them. Uh, and it's also important to know that most emerging infectious disease have their origin in wild animals. And suspending unsafe sale of live mammals for food will reduce the chances of a virus spillover in the future. This is not a new recommendation, but COVID-19 has brought new attention to this threat given the magnitude of its consequences. So it was uh, something that we were working on. It's not a first guidance. We have issued several updates on the same subject. For example, uh, we have issued uh, guidance for sellers um, on traditional uh, markets. And this one is a new guidance to help countries uh, understand the importance of suspending as an emergency measure the sale of wild uh, uh, life uh, animals in traditional markets.